All right, here's a little update on the 123. Uh, big weekend, got a lot done. Uh, started off with the trip to the junkyard and uh, had to get a new radiator. Uh, when I took the engine out, it uh, slipped on the, uh, the lift and it, it went right into the radiator and fan. So that's all taken care of now. My son and I were able to get the engine in and transmission in yesterday. So really everything from the bell housing, if you will, uh, back is done. So transmission's all bolted up, uh, the jags that run, adapter plates, the drive shaft, all of that's done. So most of the turbo stuff is in line here. I got the oil feed line for the, the HX40 Super, uh, but not the small hole set. So I need to have a hose made for that. And then I need to make the drain lines. So the drain lines, uh, I already have the hose. And if you look on the Facebook page, you'll probably see that I had my oil pan modified and have a 10 AN bung welded to the pan. So that'll be for one whole set. And then I'll use a stock 606 drain for the other turbo. So everything up front is in. Still got to tighten down that crank pulley. I'm waiting on the lock, which should be here in a couple days. So radiator will come back out. That's why it's not fully hooked up. And uh, then I can tighten that crank pulley down. So on this side, we are also pretty much good to go. I just need to hook up the fuel lines. Um, I'm waiting on fittings for the um, oil cooler right now. So once I get those new fittings in, I can run the lines to the oil cooler. Uh, my current hoses won't work. They'll need to be a little bit longer and I'll have to get some uh, angled fittings for that. So I need to wait for those to show up before I, I make the hoses. So other than that, uh, we are hopefully days away from running. Now, I still need to place the order for my gauges. Uh, I've been procrastinating on that because I don't know what I want, uh, but the time has come where I just need to uh, suck it up and make a decision and get going. Uh, fearing that it's gonna take a couple weeks, I went ahead and put the stock, uh, actually that's the um, 617 temperature sensor in it. That's not even the one that came with the 606. And then, um, for the oil pressure line, I went ahead and stuck in the original 123 line, and if my gauges don't show up in time, I'm just going to have that oil pressure gauge. Uh, I'll probably just tie wrap it to my, my vacuum line here, make sure I have oil pressure, and then I want to take this thing out and I want to see what it does. Um, I can't wait weeks for gauges at this point. It's, it's killing me. So that's the status of the car. Uh, I appreciate everybody watching. Lots of comments lately on Facebook. And uh, thanks for the sense of community. And I hope everybody uh, has a great weekend.